The momentum for translating ideas into actions is not part of our strategic planning process. Last fall, more than 40 CSE volunteers and staff members took part of a workshop in Montreal. A top 10 strategic initiative were identify, prioritize, and approve the next day at the board meeting. The description of the initiative and the targeted deliverables are summarized in a one-page report published in the eBalton and on the CSE website for all members to know what we're working on. These priorities are in line with our Vision 2020 strategic direction and our membership growth objective of 25% per year. A very important milestone was reached on January 18, 2016. In collaboration with other associations, CSE has published the 2016 Infrastructure Report Guard. The key finding of the report is that one-third of Canada municipal infrastructure is at risk of rapid deterioration, which represents the current replacement value of $388 billion. We will be organizing a CSE Infrastructure Report Card National Tour to present the report findings in the spring and fall of this year. These presentations will be hosted by CSE sections in many cities across Canada. All members are invited to participate to better understand the fact and the key messages of the report card. We also want to invite the municipal infrastructure construction buyers, the asset management practitioners, and funding stakeholders, as well as the general public to attend the events. Finally, don't forget to register soon for the 2016 CSC Annual Conference. The team is Resilient Infrastructure. Over 600 abstract and 120 profile projects have been submitted for review and approval. Come join us in London in early June to network, learn, and discover this beautiful region. It's a rendezvous.